YouTube, 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 what's going on guys? Um, I just wanted to make a little video while I was doing this. I actually wasn't, but I said, forget it, I'm just making it, and it's possible. But this motor right here is from a 2005 Infiniti FX35. It was a bad motor. I bought the truck because I had a motor already, but the motor I had was all wheel drive. And um, I'm gonna just show you what I did, you know, to switch the rear wheel drive to all wheel drive. Chilling. But um, this is the all wheel drive motor. So basically all you gotta do is switch the upper oil pan and the motor mounts. Bracket, the motor mount brackets this and this one you gotta swap them and swap the upper oil pan because this oil pan got this um actual little piece running through it for the all-wheel drive so and it come out easy it's just a couple bolts that go around it a couple bolts that go around it and then you just pry it off a little bit and that's it so Motor mount, brackets, upper oil pan. Okay, yeah, before I forget. In order to remove the upper oil pan, you gotta take off the lower oil pan, which is the little black one that's right here. And you gotta take out this bolt right there, that bolt right there, and there's three more over here. One, I can't, you can't really see it now. Okay, one, two, and three. three so you remove those and then you can um you know pry the upper oil pan apart so it's they all around the, like the corner is one two three four five it's five of them they're twelves so don't get it mixed up and yeah pretty much it for the most part show you guys the truck while I'm at it this truck got a hundred and five no a hundred and six thousand miles um yeah so it's for sale it's cool roof rack got the clear tail light with the 20s on it you know I would lift the hood up, but it ain't connected. I don't want to fall and scratch up the paint. So, this is the rear wheel drive. It's trash, it's garbage. And this is the all wheel drive, it's good. And I'ma just swap the, um, the flywheel, cause I don't know where I put the one that for the all wheel drive. Oh yeah. And um, silicone is back around here, and you might as well change your rear main seal and your front main seal while you're in there, or just whatever. Change your front main seal and you put it back together. I don't know, whatever sounds easy to you, whatever. But make sure you silicone all this stuff because you do not want any leaks, trust me. So, I'll be posting this video. Hope it helps you guys in the Infinity Club world. Yeah. So this this is the um the Infinity FX from 03 to 07 or 08 I guess. But it's the non uprev motor. I, I never really laid hands on the uprev motor. So if this the non uprev motor, you could do this. Have a great day.